long as that that money right and long as that money right and long as that money right <laughs> Trying to run this dough. YouTube, I know it's been a while. Appreciate you tuning in to my subscribers, new subscribers, new viewers. You new tuning in? Hit that subscribe button for me. I'm trying to see how I can get these visuals together while I'm working because with Domino's, man, you gotta hustle. So I couldn't neglect my job and make videos at the same time, but that that's just excuses. I'm gonna get it together. Trust and believe, man. I'm gonna start pumping these videos out. But let's get to the title, man. How I made $8,000 in a month. How I'm making $8,000 every month. I'm gonna be honest with you. I didn't like Domino's at the beginning. Coming from being a flatbed, it was more physically demanding. Like, don't get me wrong, but flatbedding is physically demanding, but this right here is very physically demanding. My first two weeks, well, my first week was hell. I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm talking about my pinkies was hurting, my toes was hurting, my back was hurting, everything hurting. I'm just, it was just an adjustment. Like, you know, I work out all the time and I'm in shape, but this was a different type of working environment for me. You know, I never did touch freight. So it was definitely an adjustment, but I'm be honest with you, man. When I got that first check and I'm like, oh. Okay, okay, I could, I can, I could rock with this. All right, I'm, I'm rock with this. Then I got my next check. I'm like, oh, okay. Because I was, anybody who was talking to me around that time when I first started Domino's, they know. I was like, man, I don't know I can hang in here. You know, I try to keep a positive attitude, whatever I do. But to be honest with you, I was like, I don't know if I can take this, you know? But you know, when I got that first check and then I got that second check and I was like, oh, all right, huh, let me shut up and put these boots on and get to work. You know, I do three routes a week. Um, I start out Monday evening, Monday night, around eight, nine o'clock, I clock in, and I get done Tuesday evening around five, six o'clock. So from five, six o'clock, Tuesday evening until the following day, between eight and nine o'clock, Wednesday, that's when I go back in, I'm home. Then I do that again, I go back in Friday night and I'm off Saturday evening, off Sunday. And I go back in, I don't go back in until Monday evening. So comparing it from OTR to what I'm doing now, there's a lot more home time and there's a lot more money. Say October, November, December. So in three months, and I'm not, and this is not including my sign on bonus because I get that next week. I'm gonna show y'all that too, maybe. And I'm not trying to brag or boast. That's not my mentality, man. I'm just here to advise and, and inspire if I can, if you get what I'm saying. But I'm close to 28,000 in three months. I ain't never made that type of money. So if you have a CDL and you want to get into the lane that's going to give you that, that money, that, that, that real money, that the money that we deserve, 
I would say go in the touch freight, you know, Domino's. Um, I heard Papa John's is pretty similar, but you know, Domino's is where it's at for me right now. So I ain't going nowhere no time soon. It's just different. say people come in and make $85,000. No, you're going to come in and make probably a hundred, 110. I know people that I work with now, Domino's make, that made 130, 140 this year. The route mall right now pays around $700 a day. After a month and I got used to what I was doing, I got my body acclimated to what I was doing. I started doing extra routes. You gotta think, when you're working, yeah, you probably think, oh, it's, it's a lot of hours, like 20, 24 hours, but it's two people. So while my partner is driving, I'm resting. While I'm driving, my partner is resting. It's two clocks. So when I got my body acclimated to doing this type of work, I said, let me do some extra. Let me see what it look like when I do some extra. So when you do extra work, they give you an incentive pay. It could be between $150 to $300. I've seen it go to $500 and I've seen it be $1,000. And that's all that money on top of your route. So say my route 700 and they're paying you $1,000 extra just to run around because they really need this route to be pumped out. You, you can make $1,700 in a day. A lot of you not. If anybody from Domino's is watching this, leave a comment, let them know. Let them know, leave a comment, let them know. Not trying to brag or boast and give it to you black and white, giving y'all the real, oh, my thoughts on my experience with Domino's. And I'm gonna tell you this, every company has their things. Things that you're not gonna like, things that you don't agree with, rules that you don't agree with. But look, long as that, that money right, and long as that money right, and long as that money right. <laughs> if you break down, you're still getting paid by the hour. If you're low not ready, you can still get paid by the hour. I hope I covered all the questions that people have been sending me. But um, if you got any more questions, just leave a comment. People who know, leave comments on my channel. Then I reply. If you got any questions, hit me up. Y'all already know my motto. Progression is a weapon. Put God first. <laughs>